first smell of spring today. Weather's warmed up, sun's out, trees are blossoming. It's looking good. Check this out. We've got a bit of growth in some areas around the house where the temperature's a bit warmer, so I think we should start a mow right now. <laughs> Yo mate, what up? Welcome in the einem anderen Rasentipp vid. G'day from Berlin. Thanks for that intro Nathan. Sounds a bit funny in German, but hope you're enjoying your time over there. Lawn, it's looking pretty good. Pretty excited about how much it's grown in the last couple of days. Just a couple of updates for you guys. All the ryegrass in the garden beds is starting to die off. There's a couple of bits that I missed, so I'll get on top of those later. But anyway, we're gonna be mowing the lawn today at 15 mil, remember? I'm gonna be squeezing that down over the next couple of weeks. Well, we'll see how far we can get. I'm aiming, don't don't quote me on this, but I'm aiming to get down to eight mil, which is pretty short. So we'll see how far we can push it, but I reckon let's give it a crack, it'll be good fun. But anyway, today we're gonna mow, do those double wide stripes, have some fun, get the drone out and just have a good time. So today I'll be using the trusty old Rover reel mower. Remember I've got a 12 blade reel. Anyway, we'll get onto it and cut. Love this thing, missed it. It's been like a month since the last mode, so. I'll probably put the catch on today because we are gonna be cutting off just a little bit of grass because I've let it grow a little bit. And hopefully we get some sweet stripes. Just by looking at this, I reckon it's gonna definitely need a double cut, which ain't nothing wrong with that because she's just grown just a little bit. But I tell you what, it's looking nice. But the reason we want to do a double cut is because you can see there's a couple of stragglers just through, through here. I'll show you. Just a couple of stragglers just here and there that haven't been cut properly, which is alright, doesn't matter. Just means we need to do a double cut because it hasn't been cut in so long. Well, I definitely broke the one third rule just there. Whoops! Look how lush that is though. Oh, yes. Me. Righty, so I'm not sure if you guys could tell, but I always do a double pass around the outside, the perimeter of the lawn, just so that when I'm doing my turns and I'm doing my stripes, or just my runs, there's an area for you to turn around and you don't miss any spots as well. It just makes mowing just that little bit easier. Gives it a nice edge too, so yeah, that's about it. So well, let's get straight into the mowing. Let's do some B-roll and some drone stuff and have some fun. Those straps, double it up. So I did double cut, but I just went over the same direction when I double cut, which you probably didn't see in the video, but I did, I promise you. But man, look at that, it is looking magical. Now there is obviously still a couple of thinner spots because, you know, it hasn't completely warmed up yet, but man, it's looking good. Sun's nice, let me just show you. All right, so right on the edges, I did do a little bit of breaking the one third rule because it had grown so long. Just back behind me here, as we can see, it's a little bit yellow, but it'll come back fine. Since we're getting some warm attempts now, but yeah, I did squeeze down a little bit too. A little bit too much with the whippy snip. That's right. But man, it's looking good. Holy dooly, it looks nice. Let's get the tape measure out, eh? So I couldn't find tape measure anywhere. Hey. But I did find this little ruler, so let's just have a little measure. Eh? What are we at here? Yeah, 15 mil. 15 mils. It's looking nice, nice and green. Those double wide stripes look heaps good. 
Loving it. Loving the colour at the moment too, considering it's only just the start of spring. I reckon once I give this lawn a proper fertiliser with some granular fert, we're going to see this thing thicken up and look magical. So anyway, let me just fly the drone over top and let's have a look at it from an aerial view. But you can see sort of out the front, down towards that right hand side at the front side of the lawn you can see it's a little bit more yellow still not quite as lush it's only because of some frost burn that was there from earlier so that'll come good once we give it a fertilize but lawn's looking pretty good considering this time of year considering we've only just kicked into spring and we've only just finished frosts here in orange which you know what, i'm excited this season's going to be a good one now there is still a little bit of winter grass around the place if you saw my video from a couple of days ago there's still some winter grass around in a couple of spots here in the yard let me show you how nasty but hopefully we'll see some die off soon no damage yet but it's been like two days so you know not expecting anything drastic as of yet anyway that was just a quick video today thanks guys so much for watching really looking forward to the season looking forward to do some more mowing videos you know what how about just here we'll put a poll down the bottom i know i forgot to do this last time but let's see what stripes you guys want and the one that gets the most votes don't be absolutely silly and, and say stuff like zigzag. I suppose if you guys vote for it, I have to do it, but I shouldn't have just said that. But anyway, put your votes down below in the comments here on YouTube, and we'll see who wins, and hopefully we'll get to do some mowing within the next couple of weeks, and I'll do that for you guys. But yeah, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, or if you're new here, like this video if you enjoyed it, and you have a good week. Oi, careful. Oh, 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 that almost ended bad. <laughs>